Hello everyone, welcome back to 2230. Today, we have some unfortunate news to discuss. On Saturday, February 24, around 12.45 p.m., a devastating fire broke out at Block 131C along Canberra Crescent in Sembawang. The source of this information comes directly from a Facebook post by Ong Yi Kung, a member of Parliament for Sembawang GRC. Upon receiving the alert, the Singapore Civil Defence Force, SCDF, swiftly responded to the scene. They discovered thick black smoke billowing from a unit on the third floor of the block. The firefighters, stationed at Ishuan Fire Station, heroically entered the smoke-logged unit to extinguish the flames, which were primarily confined to the contents of a bedroom. Tragically, within the affected bedroom, SCDF found one individual who had succumbed to the fire. A paramedic pronounced this person deceased at the scene, marking a devastating loss. As a precautionary measure, authorities evacuated 30 individuals from the second to fourth floors of the building. Additionally, paramedics assessed three individuals from neighboring units for smoke inhalation. While one of them required transportation to Singapore General Hospital, the other two declined medical assistance. The prompt and efficient actions of the SCDF, police, and paramedics undoubtedly prevented further casualties and injuries. At present, investigations into the cause of the fire are underway. It is imperative to determine the root cause to prevent such tragedies from recurring in the future. Meanwhile, the community is rallying together to support those affected by this incident. Sembawang GRC MP Ong Yi Kung, in his Facebook statement, assured that the fire did not extend to neighboring units. He expressed gratitude towards the SCDF for their rapid response and announced forthcoming assistance from HDB, the town council, and community organizations for those impacted by the fire. This tragic event serves as a somber reminder of the importance of fire safety measures within our homes and communities. As investigations continue, let us keep the affected individuals and their families in our thoughts and prayers. We extend our deepest condolences to the family and loved ones of the deceased. Stay tuned for further updates on this developing story. If you found this information valuable, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more updates on news and events shaping our community. And please, share your thoughts in the comments below. Your engagement helps us grow and reach more viewers. Thank you for watching, and stay safe.